Hey folks, how you doing? This is Shock, and you've got to see this. A bunch of you have sent me this clip of Matt Dillahunty, who is the host of the Atheist Experience fiction TV show. And it's a fictional show where they talk about atheism. And you see right behind Matt is a picture of the spaghetti monster. They actually believe that the spaghetti monster exists. Although I have some bad news. I had the spaghetti monster for dinner tonight. And he had a aftertaste of bitterness, foolishness, and hatred. And stupidity. But speaking of that... Um, I'm going to show you a video. Don't forget to check out this one titled Matt Dillahunty Own and Exposed Here. But a lot of you have said, oh my gosh, you know, Matt contradicts himself a lot. And he is an atheist, so we do know that atheism contradicts itself. So I'm going to show you where Matt says the only thing that's important to him is truth, right? But then in this video here, titled Atheist Matt Dillahunty Loses Debate Says He Doesn't Know, click right below this video or click the annotation and you're going to see this video where he says that he doesn't know if truth endures. So, in other words, he doesn't know if truth is enduring, yet he says the, the only thing that matters to him is truth. Yet he doesn't know about truth. He doesn't even know if truth endures. So, First, we're going to go to the clip where he says the only thing that matters to him, he doesn't give a, um, well, I'll let him say it, but he basically says he doesn't care what anyone else says. He just cares about truth, right? Fine. But then here he admits that he doesn't know if truth is enduring. In other words, to him, truth doesn't last. It just changes. It's, uh, in, in his opinion, he says he doesn't know about truth. You're going to hear the guy debating him. And by the way, Matt lost this debate. The, the uh, guy asked him in debate, is truth enduring? Now, if Matt says truth is important to him, then he should say, yes, truth is enduring. But as an atheist, he can't say truth is enduring because atheism is a lie. It has nothing to do with truth. So first, we're going to hear him say that the only thing that matters to him is truth. And then click right below here and watch the video which I'm going to play you a clip here where he says he doesn't know about truth. So watch. Listen closely. Let me turn the volume up. I could give a damn what most people believe. I only care about what's actually true. It, it, and to the extent that most people believe something and it turns out to be right, it's just as coincidental as the ones where the, the minority believes it and it turned out to be right. Okay, so he says he doesn't he just cares about truth, right? He doesn't give a damn what anyone thinks according to him. But now here, when he's asked about truth, he says he doesn't know about truth. Watch this. Is truth enduring? Is there, is there a category of enduring truth? I don't know. Did you hear that? He said he doesn't know. So here he says truth is important. That's all he cares about, right? When he says he don't care and give a damn of what other people think. But here he says he doesn't know about truth. Matt has a split personality. Here he doesn't know about truth. Here he says truth is all that matters. There's two different people here, but it's the same person contradicting themselves. Click right below this video and watch the video where he loses the debate where he says he doesn't know if truth endures yet in this video he's saying that's all he cares about is truth yet here he contradicts himself and says let me play it again he doesn't know this is so pathetic why uh, there's physical conceptual and truth <laughs> not really not as an exit is truth enduring is there is there in a category of enduring truth i don't know now, do you see that? This is not edited. He said he doesn't know. Now, so we, we got a problem here, guys. Atheism causes madness. You have him here saying he doesn't know about truth. And over here he said that's all that's important to him. Is truth enduring? I don't know, he says. Over here, though, he says he doesn't give a damn what anyone thinks. He just cares about truth. But yet over here he says he doesn't know about truth. He's contradicting himself. Here he doesn't know. Here he says that's all he cares about. So he cares about something that he doesn't know about. Ladies and gentlemen, this is madness. This is atheism in its purest form. 
Don't forget to click below here and you could hear him say he does not know. Guys, look, atheism will turn your world upside down. It is madness in its purest form.